We don't think that, I, that he's flying with me. I'm just, I'm just a passenger on his plane, going wherever it is that he wants to take me. That's, that's the good theology. You know, the only, high, the only I, the only ego, the only self that we have in our conversations about God is I will surrender to him. I didn't do this. I haven't gone this place. I haven't accomplished this. I have only surrendered to him. And then he has done everything through me. He is the one that does. I get to go along with the ride because I've surrendered to him. It's his will, not my will. And anytime you say God's will, people go, ah, but what is it? What is God's will? Tell me. I want to know. I want to write it down so I can make sure I'm doing it. I'm going to tell you. You will know his will when you start walking in his ways. You will know his will for your life when you start walking in his ways. If you're waiting for him to tell you his will before you move, then you're taking authority. You're not walking in faith. You're dictating to him how things need to go, and it's his plans, not our plans. Let me put this in the shortest possible sentence that I can. Fully surrender. Fully surrender.